Hey guys, it's your girl JS. I haven't done a new episode of Hair Scam in a minute, but I'm here to do a new episode. This time with TD Hair on Amazon, I purchased a wig supposed to be blue human hair. And I teach people all the time, like, you know if it's human based off the texture. And if it feels like plastic or some type of like hay, straw, it just feels hard, when it's supposed to be feeling soft or silky smooth, something like that, it's not... It's not human hair, okay? Ooh, baby. And I've worn this for a week because I wanted to give you guys a full review. A lot of these companies are giving you guys, and some people don't know that because some people are like, wash it, duh. You know, out the pack, out the box, it should automatically feel human, okay? Feel soft, everything, like real hair, and it should be real hair, okay? This one... It looks great color great fire part um the lace was on point but smelt like plastic and i just like i demonstrated that in my first episode i used what the flat iron okay flat iron test and then using heat you'll know if it's real or not based off the smell which it does smell like plastic but it does give me a little curl and it moves in the direction that I put the flat iron. But the difference between the hair I reviewed the first time and this hair is that it's heat resistant hair. And that's what a lot of companies have been mixing in and telling people that it's human hair wig. But the picture that they posted on Amazon, they had this girl, she had nice hair, it was blue, super dope. And that on the model's head was human hair. But the hair that I received doesn't come close. And when you lift it up, you start to see more of like a sky blue streaks in it. This is what it looks like in the inside and you see that I cut the lace just so you know. And I also had to use like some markers to like color it in because the lace was just too light. Comes down to this wig, I would not suggest it at all. I would not suggest this company because this is false advertising. It's called TD Hair. And it's on Amazon. I'll put the link to the, this hair in the description box just so you know what not to buy. And it's called a lace front human hair wig straight short bob deep part 180% density pre-plucked hairline with baby hair bleach knots for black women. Based off this, based off this like I said it's like a lighter shade of brown or a white person. This right here does not give me black. Flat iron on human hair, it does not get smoky. As you can see, if you, it gets really, really smoky when I'm going, because it's burning that plastic substance in this wig. This wig is eight inches, right? $67 on Amazon. But this is not human hair. It would have been dope if it was a real human hair wig, but it's not. It's a heat resistant wig. So yeah. I did the I did the human hair test, the flat iron test, okay, that's what I do. And I also just run through it and it just feels like straw, it smells, it has that plastic smell. And yeah, some of it's soft and some of it feels like hay. Had to give you guys the real. This is why I take the wig off, wrap my hair, and we break down why this wig is fake. I love you guys so much, and if you've ever heard of this company, let me know in the comment section, share, like this video, and I'll see you later.